living though, right? The grass? The grass is fine. That's what you What grass? Oh, the grass in the yard. Yeah, it looks fine. Is everything set in shape of, like, tea? Lewiston? Yes, I don't do fine. Full support? Well, I'm gonna go now. Why? It's too late, no one's gonna come to tea now. Siri, what time is it? The time is 6.20 p.m. It's only two to four. Absolutely, where you live, my dearest one? It certainly is. Are you in love with me, or why did I have to come alone? That's the secret of Castle Rack, man. Tell you should show up to go far away and spend an hour. Come back in an hour, Fergie. Her name's Fergie. Does the gasoline hurt her nose much? I don't think so. Why? Well, that's funny. What's funny? See you again. We've met before. I'm sorry about the clock. Don't worry about the clock. We haven't met in many years. It'll be five years next November. Um, I've got to go get cheetahs from the Dollar General. Where are you going? I'll be back. Uh, hold on, I need to talk to you about something. Oh god. What's the matter? This is a terrible mistake. A terrible, terrible mistake. You're just embarrassed. Daniel's embarrassed too. He's embarrassed. Just as much as you are. <sighs> Don't talk so loud. You're being a little girl. And not only that, but you're being rude. Daniel is out there. All alone. Sweet, delicious, divine, sugar crush. Oh, hello, old sport. It stopped raining. Has it? It stopped raining, Daniel. I'm glad, Jamie. How about we all go over to my house? I'd love to show them around. Are you sure you want me to come? Absolutely, old sport! I'm gonna go wash my face. Look at my house over there. Don't you just love the way it gleams in the sunlight? It certainly is splendid. Yes, old sport. It took me three years to earn the money for that house. I thought you inherited your money. I did, but I lost it in the panic. The panic of the war, old sport. What kind of business are you in? I'm in lots of businesses. Or, I mean, I was, anyway. I was in the drugstore business, the oil industry. I'm in none of them now. What, are you trying to tell me you're interested in the offer? I... Wait, that big one over there? Yeah, that's mine. Do you like it? I love it, but I can't see how you could live there all alone. Oh, I have lots of people living there. Entertaining people. Let's go, shall we? Come along, guys, and I'll show you my bedroom. I got a gal in England. She sends me new clothes at the beginning of every season, spring and fall. Here, take a look at this. Isn't it lovely? Such beautiful clothes. I'm, it makes me sad because I've never seen such beautiful clothes. Dan Cody, old sport. He died way back. 
I love him with my best friend. I love him with all my heart. I know what we'll do. We'll call Cliff Springer. She plays the piano. You ain't. Did we interrupt your exercises? I was asleep. That is, I had been asleep. Then I got up. You and Stellar at the piano. Oh, no, I don't really play. I'm all out of practice. was to gender bend so we decided that it would be kind of cool if we did that because it's a really emotional scene for both Gatsby and Daisy and so if you kind of flip-flop that it makes it really humorous because you know you got a guy crying over clothes and you've got some chick over here like look at my clothes so it's not too far off from real life but it's still kind of humorous we tried to make the costuming as period appropriate as possible we used my mom's help a lot since she is like the main costume mom for the musical and we used some stuff from the school some stuff we made and some stuff that my mom just had in her closet <laughs> so we did make some changes to the scenes and just the overall script one of the main things we did is change up the words a little bit, mainly because some people can't memorize words very well. And then, and then we changed uh, the part with Dan Cody because it didn't seem to add so much emotion to the play. And since we're only doing chapter five, we really wanted to carry as much emotion as possible. So we did reference it and use that as sort of a comedical take. And then lastly, um, at the very end, um, musical. <laughs> He's played my, by my brother's cardboard cutout of himself. Yeah. She said comedical. Comical. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. We did modernize the whole thing. So at one point we asked Siri for the time instead of uh, Nick looking at the clock. And we also had Nick playing Candy Crush instead of just chilling in the rain. Partially because it wasn't raining. Yeah. It was a little bit. It was like tad raining. <laughs> what? It's tattery. A tad. It's raining a tad. And we played Love Shack. Uh, yeah. But no, guys, no, then. we should have just all waved and let it be over with. <laughs> <laughs>